What's up everybody, Brian Clark here with my boy Bauer, who's very excited, so excited he wants to leave. Oh, ow, oh, shit. And we're excited to share with you the features in this month's release of Visual Studio Code for February 2018. Let's take a look at some of the highlights in it. Check it. You could always open up multiple terminals, but now you can split them to stay in the same view. Use this to run multiple processes or commands in different projects. Or better yet, open up a bunch of them with the matrix effect on and tell your mom you're a 10x developer now. Ohm. Channel your inner zen more completely with the updated zen mode. With this change, your code is now centered just like your inner chi so you can stay ultra focused to get your work done. The notification pop-ups are no longer large banners across the top of VS Code. Instead, they show up as cool little toast notifications in the bottom right-hand corner of the editor. You can also choose to show or clear all notifications by clicking on the little bell icon down in that same corner. Searching for stuff all the time? Want to get more real estate for that search view? Well, check out the new search.location option found in the settings. Change it to the value panel and it will show up as a new tab in the bottom panel next to things like the terminal, output, and debug console views. This feature is currently in preview and the team would love to hear your feedback on it. This release provides transparency to see the built-in extensions that are part of VS Code. Now, why would you want to see these? Well, maybe you want to remove support for languages you're never using. Or maybe you never use the default themes and would prefer they be gone. All this is further improving your ability to customize code to your liking. There's the feature highlights for this month's release of Visual Studio Code. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm Brian Clark. This is Bauer. We really appreciate it. And if you like this video, make sure to like it, retweet it, share it with your family, like your mom, your dad, or your grandma. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time. Happy coding, everyone.